we have a study going with the UFC. Now, mind you, they can't publicly fund us because it's a Schedule One substance and they're a U.S.-based company. But we have ties with – I mean, the FDA has approved what we're doing, ties with Johns Hopkins. Uh, we have the greatest minds in psychedelics at our fingertips. And um, for the UFC to welcome me with open arms – you know, Jeff Davitsky, as you know, is a, a good friend of mine and mentor um, – he, he understands that I only have the fighter's best interest at heart and that I'm going to bring them everything possible that I can because I've healed myself. And if anyone, if I can do it, anyone else can do it. Um, and, and more specifically, the, the psilocybin does something called epigenetic neurogenesis. It's a big word, uh, but you'll hear it more and more and more. Um, it is the healing of the brain itself, having a, an extended period of time with psilocybin, again, that active ingredient in magic mushrooms in your brain. Um, you actually heal the brain itself. You heal the receptor sites and the neural pathways, create new neural pathways, get each hemisphere of your brain speaking much more than it usually does. Um, and you see the benefits in – first is making people a better person, is dealing with the trauma, the addiction with a larger dose, you know, with a macro dose. You can make these people just more comfortable in their own skin. 